Hey guys, what is going on? It is CTGS Frost, also known as Shoddy, also known as Shoddy Gaming. I am back today with another video, and today I'm going to be doing some stuff on Rainbow Six, which is really interesting. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm going to be doing some crazy things on exactly what the hell just was dropped today, as the Brazilian operators are approaching us that are on August 2nd. Same thing with the GTA DLC. This is the video number one of two that I'm going to be posting today. Guys, hopefully you guys check out the other one. Today, I'm going to be doing a video on Rainbow right now. I'll be uploading one in about two or three hours, guys. It'll be about GTA. These two games about to go head-to-head, -head, and they're about to have the update on the same day. If you pre-ordered, or if you have the season pass for Rainbow Six, you will get it on the second. So, I'm going to be posting a live stream about Rainbow Six early in the morning. So, make sure you guys check that out. It will not be. It'll be on August 2nd. And then later that night, I'm going to do the one on the DLC, where I'm going to be creating a race. I'm going to see what it's like. Other than that, guys, make sure you guys click that like button right now. And another thing is, guys, I'm about to be checking out. I'm going to show you guys this video, or not video, this picture that I just got. Literally, as soon as I got a rainbow, it is insane. It's just utterly a crazy. Like, this is, like, literally what it's going to be called now. Like, how the last two operators had insane names as their operations. Well, we can all just wait until J set because that'll be amazing when the Japan set comes out. So, guys, other than that, here's the photo that I was sent to today. This is insane. This insane picture came up. It's called Skull Rain, which was the operation of the new Brazilian operators. What is great about this is one of those characters is called Skull, and the special abilities are more tense, like, crazy, and the fact that I think Skull is the one that has the crossbow because... And if it's not, it's the one that can interrogate. But the one with the crossbow, I'm going to explain them both right now. The one with the crossbow shoots an oxygen detoxer into the room, and it will take away the oxygen out of the room and suffocate its victim that is inside the room. But one problem is this, is if we're playing hostage and they shoot into the room, it could kill the hostage, which would suck dick. Alright, so now we're going to go to Skull if it's not. I, I don't know which one's which. One's named Capital and the other one's named skull but the second one is able to go mute on its uh, like when it walks it goes quiet it's kind of like a mute device but it just makes it go quiet kind of like a from advanced warfare or anything like that the stupid blast things that go like they mute the sound of jumping it's kind of like that but this time you won't be able to hear them walk for about maybe 10 seconds and that's it it will be on a cooldown, guys, but what is great about this is when they do do this, you can be interrogated by the other person. So, what will be crazy about that is if we can't shoot the person themselves who is interrogating, the best option would be just to shoot the people that is being interrogated. Because you don't want the information shown where all you guys are. It's kind of like an Overwatch, or not an Overwatch you're thinking of, like an over, over, um, overall, kind of like if you were to take a drone and scan a massive scan would be the same thing as what the interrogation can do. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's not going to show, like, complete outlines of you, but it will show the little red dots where you guys are while you're being interrogated. So, you guys, make sure you guys watch out for that shit, because that will suck if you get spotted that way. Remember, just shoot the people on the ground. All right, guys, so the next topic is going to be on more so I'm going to explain a little more. All right, so here we go. Okay guys, one of the guns that I have found out the name of is called the Para. It's P-A-R-A, -A, and it's like a 308. So it looks like the Galil from Black Ops 1. So if anyone remembers what that gun looked like, that is exactly what that gun is. But right now, I don't know any of the other gun names, except the other one looks like a Spectre. So I'm just going to get right into my ending, guys. So I hope you guys enjoy. Guys, the last thing I'm going to bring up today is, this is going to be one of the overpowered characters. They're both going to be overpowered, especially with the Galil. I just cannot wait until J sat because that is the end of the year one map, guys. Other than that, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys karate chop that like button. I'll catch you guys again soon. It's been great talking to you guys. It's great to bring you guys news. And make sure you guys check out my Twitter, Shoddy Gaming. Alright, guys. So, other than that, guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed today. Make sure you guys check out my other videos. I will be posting another one in about two to three hours, guys. So, make sure you guys check that one out. Other than that, guys, this has been the final and official end of this video. I'll catch you guys again soon. It's been CTGS Frost, also known as Shoddy, and I say peace. Oh, fuck, come on.